Hey guys, it's John and welcome back to Elden Ring Part 20! We're so far into the series. In the last episode, in Part 19, we fought two ulcerated tree spirits, one of which was a big jump scare, my biggest jump scare of the year so far, and we completed Ronnie's quest line. We also encountered the long-awaited Glintstone Dragon Agila, which we fought earlier, and they're way easier than they are now. So, in this one, we're gonna keep going with whatever we were doing. It's been about two weeks since I last played. It's April 16th today, and the last time I played was April 2nd. This is probably going up in June, so... You guys are probably horrified right now. Probably gasping, clutching your pearls. I had no idea he played this so long ago. What took so long? Uh, believe it or not, these videos take a long time to do. They just do. Wait, am I still running Pizza Cutter? What's- what's even my build right now? Strength and Dexterity, okay. Great. And I also think, actually, I don't think I ever did this ever, Jail. So let me just... Let me just fix that real quick. Okay. Uh, let's go fight some... things, I guess. Hey! Oh my gosh. Oh my god! I suck at the game now! Dude, two weeks is all it takes, apparently, to just lose everything that you've learned. It's... <laughs> oh, maybe I'll come back to this later. Holy sh- I can't do anything right here. I can't do a single thing right. I'm actually gonna do something, I, I can't remember if I talked about this in the last video or not, but I kinda wanna go back to my... I kinda wanna go back to like a magic build. Did I say that? Did I say anything about that at the end of the last video? I kind of want to do some magic stuff, so I'm gonna respec real quick. No offense to the pizza cutter, I like it and all, but okay, we're gonna go 40 intelligence. I wanted, I, I got it, I got 12, 18, so I could use the Moonveil katana. Okay, so I decided to do the same vigor, same mind, same endurance. Re decreased uh, strength by 20, dexterity by 10, and increased intelligence by 30. Because we're gonna we're gonna be doing some magics. Thou art now a sweeting, full, fine, and fair. Uh, My yeah. Oh, shut up! You're so weird. Did you know that? Where's my Moonveil katana? Let's put, let's bring that that puppy out. <laughs> I put the Snow Witch hat on. That doesn't really work, actually. All right, look at me. Now I look like a caster. Let's go try this out. And you know where I like to try this stuff out. It's on our our good friend. All right, here we are. Oh! <laughs> oh. Okay, it didn't actually. I was kind of hoping it would do more damage than that. Ow. Okay. Okay. Oh no. Oh no, I'm out. Wait, wait. I gotta get more. Okay, okay. Come here. See, this actually doesn't work because he's got a shield! Get him. Hmm. Come on, buddy. Okay, this isn't actually working out great so far. Also, I kind of forgot how to play, so, you know, there's that. Two weeks will rust you up. This guy's really kicking my ass. Look at him. Watch this. Thought I forgot about that move. Turns out I didn't. Okay, well that wasn't as impressive as I thought it would be. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I think I'm going to allocate 7-4 for now. And uh, if it doesn't work out, then we can... You know, we can do it another time. But, I think that having more MP or F FP would be good for us. Okay, let's try it out. Let's try it on these guys. Somebody without a shield. Where are they? Hey, hey there's some over here. Hey, idiot. 
Okay. You know what? Let's just go. Okay, that's a pretty good. <laughs> okay, you do have a range on it, it looks like. Still, fairly painless. Fairly painless way to play against these guys. Okay. Well, there was a little bit of pain there. A little bit of pain. But still, overall, not bad. Now, this... This status effect does instantly kill you. So there is that. Fairly boring, but kind of fun. I did enjoy that. Let's see if we can take out... Is there something over by the Erd tree? That's what I want to know. Because I don't think there's an Erd tree avatar over here. But I think there might be some other big boss. Yeah, let's bring out... Let's bring out the jellyfish. These guys go down easy. Okay, maybe we kill this thing, actually. Yep. Oh, it's Worm Face! He's got a name! Okay. How about this? That was pretty good. It's Loretta's Great Bow, y'all! Okay. I understand. That's not bad. Oh! Oh! We want to get out of there. Okay. We want to get out of there. Let's flask up. What are you doing? Do you think that was going to be effective? Oh, no, no, no. No. Oh. Dude, bro. Bro, no. No, don't do it. No, I'm so sorry. I, I won't trash talk you anymore. I may I'll trash talk you a little bit. I was kind of expecting you to kill me there. Oh, no. You killed me. There's nothing like this game for comedic timing. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Stop doing that! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> You're incorrigible! Okay, worm face. How many times are you gonna do that? How many times do I have to dodge out of the way before you get discouraged? Whoever knew that Wormface would be so optimistic? Nothing gets them down. Okay. Wow. Okay. Get him, jellyfish! It's just worm face. Come on, buddy. You got worms all over you. You got eight of them. Okay. Try this again. I think we got him. My pebble was too strong. Crimson spill, crystal tear, and speckled hard tear. Nice. So we we still got those uh crystal tears or whatever for the flask of wondrous physic. We still got them. Oh fuck off. All right, crimson spill, crystal tear temporarily boosts max HP in mixed physic. Okay. I'm not like head over heels for that. 
Uh, speckled hard tier boosts resistance and heals status in mixed physic. Okay. And, uh, what do I have in there already? Dexterity and, uh, stamina recovery. I just feel like it's gonna be hard to beat that. I- I'm really open to experimenting with different mixed physics, but I just feel like the one that I have is the best. You know? <laughs> Dude. Magic feels like cheating. Oh, don't mind me, I'm just murdering slugs. If you're wondering what I'm up to, nothing much. These ruins are a bust, by the way. You'd think that since they're right next to the minor urge tree, they'd be something, but they're not. I'm also, I am rolling. I don't know if I'm just not rolling in the right place or what, but there is nothing cool so far. Visions of treasure chest, dude, I know. I'm right there with you, I'm frustrated too, there's nothing here. Was this the wood folk ruins? Yeah, I mean, was I, was I here in a previous video? Did I like, maybe I did something here. Oh, there's a lot of these guys. I probably left. Yeah, I probably didn't fight these guys. This is probably it then, the, the southernmost one. Okay, here. Oh, holy shit, that was awesome! <laughs> I didn't have to go anywhere near him. I did use up all of my FP. But that that cannon is uh, no joke. What about the shattering crystal? I wonder. Oh, pretty good. Oh, nice. Oh, you need a lot of you need a lot of uh, minds to do it though. Yeah, that cannon is pretty cool, but you can only do it a couple times unless you've got a lot of mind. Hi. Get out of there. Only one left. Let's see if we can just take him down with the katana. Oh my gosh. Dude, the fact that, like, Blight is... Insta dead really worries me. Get out of there. Oh, whoa. These guys, these worm face, mini worm faces. Oh, yeah, the old walking guy. I think that's why I got distracted by last time I was over here. Anyway, let's go down. Check this place out. Could there be a treasure chest? Visions of treasure chest. I don't think I already went down here. If I already went down here, I'm gonna be so sad. Incantation. No way. What? Wrath of gold? An incantation? I did all that for an incantation. You've gotta be shitting me. All right, up here by the windmills. Hey, it's one of you. You were dancing earlier. Of course, now you're hostile to me for God knows why. It, it really doesn't work out for you. Now, if we're being real, a lot of you guys probably never found this. You probably were main quest only. I'm amazed at how many people, uh... Main quest only this game. It's like, you're not gonna take advantage of the fact that it's like... Incredibly open world and... There's so much to see and do. You're just gonna main quest it, really? I feel like it's not taking advantage of the like the reason why the game is really fun. Like to think that there's a lot of people that play this game that never saw Knock on the Eternal City makes me kind of sad. There's some ruins over here, so I just figured I'd, I'd come over. Watch this. It never gets old doing that. Somber Smithing Stone 5, is that all that's here? 
Okay. Really? I mean, I saw... Hmm. Tarnished. We should, start, should I start rolling on the ground? Maybe up here? What? Goodbye. Holy shit! What the fuck? That really took me by surprise. I was not prepared for that. It's the Lion Guardian. It was disguised. Didn't- wasn't there a bear that did that? There was a bear that did that and like Part two or something. Oh, no Strong foe ahead all right uh, Should we try it again? Didn't really work out how I wanted to, but that was a pretty good fight, actually. A larval tear. Nice. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. A larval tear for all that. Cool, dude. Now I can just slaughter these guys with no guilt whatsoever. There's actually quite a few windmills, and they go all the way up to the top over here. Whoa! Oh, wow. Dickheads. Okay, I'm coming back for y'all. Dominula. Windmill village. Watch out. Ooh, there's a side of grace here. And a guy. Eek. I hear a festive melody. No, no, don't skin me. My hide is filthy, I swear. Well, I'm guessing they skinned ya, huh? Oh, what's this? Look, there's a wreath over here. Oh, look, they're, they're dancing and shit. That's cool. Look, they're happy! See, they're happy. Isn't that nice? They're not attacking me, so I won't attack them. They're peaceful old crones. I swear if it's one of those marionette things, just because they kind of move in like a windmill-esque position. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. You were a weird one. Lightning grease. Look, the rest of them are happy though. They don't care that I killed you. Look, no one will even know. <laughs> That's right. None of them, none of them even know. None of them in the hive mind. See, look, they're happy. They don't give a shit that you're dead. You guys praying to the windmill? Oh shit. You sure you wanna do this? Yeah, see? Y'all mind your own business, you won't end up like them. Dead on the ground. I think we're getting closer to the truth. My investigation 
has brought me here. Oh, we can summon. Oh, okay, wait. Is that a, that's a god skin apostle. It is. Oh, I was going over here for the, oh man. Gonna have quite a different... Ow. Quite a different fight against it this time, though. Okay. We're having a long-range battle so far. Let's go. Here we go. Ooh. Okay. That was okay. Not awesome. Man, I, I, have, I have it so easy. And I can't even dodge his attacks. Oh, oh. Well, now I can. Well, if this is all he's got, then I'm fine with that. Maybe I'll come up close. Okay, maybe don't do that. Okay. No, leave my jellyfish alone! My poor jellyfish! Okay. Here's the part where we do this. Oh, oh, get him! Damn, damn, damn! Bro, this guy. Ow. Okay. Leave my jellyfish alone! You're much easier than that first time. I think probably because I ranged you down for, like, most of the battle. That's it, a godskin up- Godskin peeler. Scouring black flame. Pretty cool. A godskin peeler, that seems- Although I was- I was impressed by the name of your previous weapon that you gave me, and then it turned out to not be that great. Was that a- Actually, is that like a twin blade or something? It kinda- Oh, it is- it, it is a twin blade! It's got really good deck scaling, too. It's got C off the bat. Black Flame Tornado, as well, is the skill that it comes with. Okay, that's cool. I might have to switch back to the Twin Blade, because I really- I want to bring Darth Yaw back. At a certain point, we gotta do that. There's actually a Sight of Grace over here? Oh my gosh, right here. I think it might just be a Godskin Apostle hanging out. Although, what's this? Don't tell me there's like a cave down there. Still no treasure chest. Fuck. We were not rewarded for our curiosity. I mean, I guess we were the Godskin Peeler seems really cool, actually. That's a really cool weapon. So I'm glad I came up here and I got it. Okay. We're back down here and, uh, don't think I've forgotten about our friends over this way with the cannonballs. Don't think I've forgotten about that. Because I haven't. We're gonna go teach them a lesson right now. These are trebuchets, they have a counterweight. Right? I don't want anyone getting mad at me. The medieval weapon community is surprisingly strict about this type of stuff. Got him. Sweet revenge. Hey, friends. Hee <laughs> hee. Uh, it's actually, like, less satisfying than I thought. Oh my god! Okay, that was more satisfying. We can also go into the, uh, oh my gosh, the sit the capital from this way. Excuse me. Oh my gosh. Did you see that? I got a special skill for you. Actually. <laughs> Dude, the Moonveil Katana is, like, ridiculous. What, what, no, it's not time to walk away. I'm still here. 
Did you see that guy? He was like, I guess I'll just go back to my station. No. No, you don't. You treat me with respect. Okay, okay, for real. What is it? What is it? Bow ahead. Oh, it's a bow? What a waste of time. A great bow. What's so great about it? Great arrow. That's for me to decide. Trust me, it's a great bow and a great arrow. Alright, that's all that was over here. Um... I feel like I've kind of been most places in Altus Plateau. I can't figure out how to get over here. Um, but maybe I'll just leave that for another time. Cause like, I, I finished Learnia and I didn't know how to get up here. So maybe I'll just come back later and I'll figure out how to get over here. I don't... I don't know, it seems like I've been most places though. Other than that. And I've- there's no more boss tokens around except for these guys, so I think... Well, we'll go in this way, but also... Um, I might wanna just... Start going into the royal city of Landell. It seems pretty cool, actually, and I think it's about time. Seed ahead, but be wary of recklessness. There's a golden seed ahead. Oh. Huh. Wait, where's the seed? See, there was a golden seed? Oh, it was like way up here. Wait, Margaret. What? What the hell? It's Margaret! All right, well, I'm gonna do what I wish I'd done the first time. Check this out. Ow. Look at him. We're just gonna range him down. It's okay, we don't gotta fight him again. Oh my God. So weird though. Oh my gosh. What? Oh wait, he's back here, he's back here. Okay. How about this, how about this? I was about to say, he's just gonna let us hit him. Come on. Oh, these guys, look at them. He's got his little Thor's hammer, his little Mjolnir. Okay. Where are you going? Okay. I guess we keep pulling him away from where he's supposed to be, I don't know. What's the matter? This is like literally the same boss. Holy shit. Yeah, he keeps coming back here, it's weird. I'm not like exploiting him or anything, I promise. Okay. Damn. Oh my god, he killed me. Oh my god, he killed me. No, no, no. Come on. I'm just gonna do this, so you come in. Oh! Damn. Damn. 
Damn, he still got me. Oh my god. Dude. Get him. Oh. Why was he here too? Viridian Amber Medallion, plus one. Why was he here too? Dickhead. So I came in over here earlier. There's a finger reader crone, how riveting. Are we gonna fight Godric again? Is there like a weird boss rush over here? Or? Oh wait, this is another golden rune. This is different from the one that I, or golden seed rather. Cause I found one over there too. Okay. So this is the way actually into the city? Or is it to the side? There's a, there's a cave over here. Um, interestingly enough, I'm going to actually, oh gosh, I'm going to go to this one. I'm going to spend some of my runes. I think I can do that. And I've decided before we go too far into this, we're going to take out the double tree sentinel because that seems fun. And I just realized my build's not going to be great for that actually. Dickhead. Oh god. Look at him. Wait, why is it only one? Dude, he is still He's still crazy. This guy's still nuts. You know, it's interesting that they got the tree sentinel here and they got Margit inside. It's like they want you to go on a little nostalgia run. Oh gosh. Oh my god. Wow. Do you see that? Did you see that, dude? What the fuck? Did you see that jump he made? He freaking flew across the way. Retreat lost thrones! Oh my gosh. Oh my god. I dodged out of that, but okay. Nice. Oh my gosh. Okay. You know, not having to take down two at once. Actually, pretty nice. This is actually a pretty nice fight. I actually staggered him. Oh. Okay. Okay. Weird how I didn't get any runes for that. Seek flower. 
Hang on, we got another one. Yeah, we got to resummon Steed, please. Okay. Here we go. This one has a torch instead of a shield, I noticed. Interesting. Okay. Oh. Okay. Ooh, he uses the torch instead of the shield, but basically the same move set. Okay, that's what I was wondering, if he had a different move set. Or if it was the same. Come on. Darn. Nice, dude. Okay. We got the other one. Nice. Oh, now it says enemy felled. 20k that I earned. Erdtree Great Shield. Hero's Rune. What? Let me see this. Hero's Rune. Used to gain an abundance of runes. Golden Rune 12 is a great many runes. There were once heroes who walked the battlefields, abundantly blessed by the Urdtree itself, who upon earning their honor simply died. Oh, okay. I gotta say, I wasn't expecting this walk down memory lane. Double tree sentinel, Margaret, the fell omen. Once again, like, wow. So what's happening over here? Oh, what the hell? There's like plants over here and shit. Cave ahead, really? Oh, I'm a big plant. I like to exude poison. Look at me. Okay. Anyway. Get rid of that. Perfumer's Grotto. Do the perfumers really need a grotto? So what happens if I rest at the side of grace? Is it back at the entrance? No, actually it's perma dead. I like that. All right, let's check out the perfumers grotto. I've already killed a perfumer or two. Just don't like their vibe, you know? What's this? Well, I kind of knocked him off, didn't I? Oh, hi. <laughs> One more time. Uh, so if you could take it back, would you not go up there? Would you stay down on the ground? That's probably what I would do too. Hello. Go excuse me, sir. I'd like to get past. What? Okay. It's one of these freaking things. We can just range it down though. Don't even need to care. Oh, uh, good thing you're weak. Okay, one more shot, I think. Yep, die.
Yeesh. An arteria leaf. How oh, fantastic. Thank you so much. This place is actually way bigger than I thought it would be. I thought it was just gonna be a dopey little cave. Oh my god. Alright. Let's go in. Omen Killer and Miranda the Blighted Bloom. Okay, the Omen Killer died incredibly fast. I did kind of cheese him a little bit, though. <laughs> so, <laughs> the two lame bosses, though, together. Fromsoft was just like, hey, what if there were two shitty bosses instead of just one? Look at this. Anyway. Miranda the a Blighted Bloom is going down super... Wow. How about this? Super fast. Great Omen Killer Cleaver is what I got. So like a cool, like, great sword or whatever. Now, you may think, oh, you're obviously done here. But no, we're obviously not. Because look, there's actually... How do you get... Ow. Look. Right here. What is all this? Hmm. Okay, where am I? Have I gone to the Altus Tunnel? Let's go to it and just see what happens. See if it jogs any memories for us. Have we been through here? We're about to find out. No, we have not. We have not because there's a chest here that I never did. Okay, it's one of these guys. Thinks he's a little flyer. That's funny. <sighs> they love giving me these rune arcs. Okay. Smithing stone five. All right, get ready for some smithing stones, y'all. Ah, uh, I love these guys. They're so chill. You can just come up right behind them. Stab them in the back. They won't care. Yeah, look! That's where we just were! Over there! Haha, <laughs> nice. Probably means we got a different, like, um... Boss over here, then. I would think. Oh, I'm not falling down there. What? <gasps> no, you can, though. You can fall down there. Oh, gosh. Right here? Nice, dude. One stone scrap. Uh... What? I came down here for that? Oh, God. Don't fall. I hate this. Yeah, tranquility. My ass. Don't go over there. Don't tell me to go over there. Dude, it is not happening. Oh, you can go up here, though. Arsenal charm plus one! I'm equipping that right now. Greatly raises, raises maximum equip load. Actually, I'm on a light load right now. So why don't I just take this off? <laughs> Greatly raises maximum stamina. It raises it by like 15. Let's just do that. Get my stamina up. Hell yeah. That's way better than the Arsenal Charm, actually. Arsenal Charm will be better with different builds, but not with the one that I currently have. Yeah. We're not impressed by that. Arteria Leaf. Okay, that's it. What do you craft with arteria leaves? I'm looking it up. What's so great about these things? 
Arteria leaf can be used to craft the following items. Exalted flesh, uplifting aromatic, and blood boil aromatic. Exalted flesh is a consumable item, which upon use will give a 20% boost of physical attack power dealt by player for 30 seconds. I see, I've got a bunch of those and I've never used them, so thanks, thanks for that. Uplifting aromatic is a consumable item, can be used to boost ally attack power and reduce incoming damage once. It lasts 40 seconds, okay. And then blood boil aromatic, um, let's see. It drains FP to enter a, a temporary state of fervor. Okay. That just sounds like a lot of work when I could just hit stuff with my sword. I know some people just don't think that way. They want to use like every single thing to their advantage. But that's just how I am. Oh, that's the way to go, dude. That was awesome. Hilarious, even. Okay. Yeah, I'm just not, not all for the bits and baubles, I guess. Are those crystallians I see? Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, the m magic doesn't really work. There we go. Oh, that's a huge attack. That stagger. And now, look at that. Oh, yeah. You get the stagger, it's over. No, oh, I hate you. Here we go. There we go. We're gonna crack the crystal now. Yep. And that's it. Once again, FromSoft was like, what if there was two? Somberstone Miner's Bell Bearing. Okay, we got a Bell Bearing out of it? I guess it's not so bad. Oh, before I forget, let's get rid of this. And, um... Okay, I think I'm pretty satisfied with how things are out here, and we're gonna officially start moving into lane though, which means going in, you know, over here. Into the inner wall, maybe? Although there, oh, there is an Erd tree over here. A minor Erd tree. And there's a, hmm, there's a cave over here. I just feel like, those are points of interest that I maybe should go to before I go to the inner wall. Let's put another point in mind, and I'm level 100, officially. Sweet. All right, let's let's uh, let's take this road over here and see what this is all about, actually. We're actually, I thought we were in Landell after we came in there, but I guess we're still on the outskirts. I guess that's the actual city. I'm interested to see what an actual city is like. Or if it's just gonna be a typical, like, Souls City where it's just full of enemies and people that have completely lost their minds. Let's go here. This is like a, ooh, is it a church? Oh, there's like a jar here. Oh, used to be a jar. Missionary's Cookbook 4. Yeah, there used to be jars here. Oh, look. Does he have one of those things? Golden Order Seal. What the hell? And a golden centipede. Oh, there's golden centipedes all around! Whoa. There's so many. Ah, bug. 
Yeah, there's no tier. It's no sacred tier. Well, what was that thing that I just picked up? Oh, it's for incantations. Boosts fundamentalist incantations. Uh, okay. A formless sacred seal depicting the ceremonial observation of order. Enhances golden order fundamentalist incantations. Brother Corin would like that crap. Fundamentalism is scholarship in all but name. Scales incantations using both intelligence and faith. Neato. Okay, well that's all that was over here, I guess. Or maybe not, maybe it's not all that's over. Is there more stuff? Maybe we go back here? Anything? Oh, <gasps> the Divine Tower, dude. What, how do you get over there? Tell me, tell me the secrets. Not here, yeah. Beast ahead, visions of scarlet rot. Oh god. Oh yeah, there's that Coliseum over there. Wait, how do you? Okay, so there's a bunch of blood here from people trying to get down and dying. But this is the Divine Tower right here, is it not? There's gotta be some way to get to it. Alright, here we go. Let's see if we can head down. I wonder what those footprints are. I don't really have a clear answer on that yet. Okay, yeah, this is the easy way that you get down. Nice. I just had to kill one of them. They're just so smug. I hate it. Alright. What's this? Huh? Is it just like more tunnels? Yeah. Sealed tunnel. All right, I guess we'll get more smithing stones. If you're wondering how it's going, uh, I'm just slaughtering these dudes and taking all their belongings. So the usual, you know, smithing stone tunnel experience. Nothing that interesting yet. Oh. <laughs> and then that's the last thing you did before you died. Cool. Another a smithing stone miner's bell bearing. So we can buy smithing stones at the uh, round table hold. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Oh. Another hidden wall. And this goes down to the rest of it, I think. Now, before. Oh. This actually isn't quite the same. Oh. Okay. Oh, what? How do you get down from here? Oh. I guess. We could try going down this way. It's so mean. It's so mean for them to do this to you. They teach you over and over. Ugh. What? Oh, come on. What's all the tree roots? Uh, if there's another ulcerated tree spirit, I'm gonna lose it. If, if this is like a hinting at another ulcerated tree spirit, I'm literally going to spontaneously combust. I guess we just roll down here. Oh, dickheads! Oh, I hate that. I hated that. Grace Mimic, why would you do this? Why would you do that to me? Oh. That's so mean. Exploding balls. There were multiple? I thought it was just that one. And I got and I rolled away from it in time. Ooh. How dare you? Oh my gosh. 
That's so mean. There's like three of them up there. You can't. Oh. You can't kill them fast enough. I mean, I got. You, you probably could, actually. I just. I'm unable to. Now, do you think. Yeah. No more of those. I hate that. The exploding ball guys. Come on. How do you guys die here? Give me a break. Oh, the sudden camera angle change there was not cool. So actually, I kind of get it. Do you think I can make it? Oh, oh my gosh, you can. Just for some lightning grease. I risked my life for the lightning grease. Ugh. Good luck. Dude, we, we made it. Here we are. Oh my gosh. That is so mean. This- I think this is the most mean-spirited cave they've made. Well, what is this? Stonework. Huh. Oh. Boss. Weak foe ahead. Really? That's disappointing. I'm in. Onyx Lord. Oh, okay. It's just one of these guys? Incredible. Ah. <laughs> Let's get him with magic, y'all. Actually, might be better off. Incredible. Huh? You do so much damage with the Moonbail Katana. Oh, that does a lot. Okay. Let's get behind him. Come on, buddy. Get behind him again. Try not to use that move too much, but it just, it staggers so easily. It's hard not to. <laughs> I don't want to lose this guy. Look at him. Onyx Lord's great sword. Oh, I'm, I'm honored that you've bestowed it upon me. Fantastic. You can actually go deeper? What? Oh, <gasps> this. This is the- that's it! It's the Divine Tower! Yeah! That is probably the nerdiest I've ever sounded. I was wondering- I didn't verbalize it, but when I was up there, I was like, is there a cave down there? Because otherwise, how the hell are you supposed to get there? Divine Tower of West Altus. Well... We ain't going in here yet, I guess. Although, don't we have the great room from Rykard? So really, we should be going in here. Right, isn't that right? Let me take a look, real quick before we go. No, look, Rykard's great rune, devoid of any benediction. That means we gotta go in here, and we gotta activate it. Yeah? Okay. I like this, straightforward, no bullshit. 
No puzzles, no special item you have to go through an NPC quest to get. It's just like, come on up. You made it here. Get on up here. I like that. A straight shooter. I'm something of a straight shooter myself. Now, I mean, I, I assume that that's what it does. Should I step on this? No, it's not. I was expecting a trap. Well done, thanks. It was so difficult. So hard to do. Um... Yeah, look, here it is. This is- this is Rikard's, right? Cool! Great room restored. I actually don't know what Rikard's great room does, so I'm gonna go take a look real quick. Raises H- uh, maximum HP, FP, and stamina. Yeah, but is it better than Godric's great room that raises all attributes? Oh wait, no, that's Radon's. Restores HP upon defeating enemies. Huh, Rykard was amongst the children of Renala and Radagon. Oh, really? Maybe I knew that, I just forgot. Who became demigod stepchildren after Radagon's union with Queen Merica. But Rykard fed himself to the Blasphemous Serpent, great rune and all. What an idiot. And he fucked up his voice, too, when he did that. They don't even care, they don't even- This is why I mean, Godric gets so disrespected. They don't even talk about him here. They don't even talk about him. It's just like the first demigods were the Elden Lord Godfrey and his offspring, the Golden Lineage. Godric's such a footnote. Even Rikard gets talked about. Radon was amongst the children of Renal and Radigan, who became demigod stepchildren after Radigan's gene. Okay, okay. Great Rune of the Unborn. And this is. Right. The egg clutched by Renal. <laughs> Okay. Nice, that's why it's smaller than the other ones. Okay, so, you know what, that was a very peaceful Divine Tower experience, and I've come to appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, is it- is it right here? Oh no. Okay, we go through here, and then we take a right. Directly into the capital city. I think. Although I wouldn't be surprised if there were enemies on the way. Oh, okay. Nice. And this thing, I fought one of these in Kaled. Well, fought's a strong word. I didn't really do a whole lot to it. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Kinda... What the hell, dude? Why did he turn around? It's like he wasn't targeting the right person. This guy. No! I was trying to sprint out, I should have dodged. I just was too close to him. We got him down pretty good though, this is... I guess an, a mini boss version because it's got it's got no name. I don't even know what to call this thing. There you go. Okay, let's see. Actually, horseback seemed to work out pretty well. Wow! Well, look at you. Okay. Wow. Jellyfish, don't worry, I'm coming! Okay. This guy... hits like a truck.
Okay. Get this. Okay. Yeah, go after the jellyfish. <laughs> I'm sitting there like, leave my jellyfish alone, and I'm like, yeah, go after the jellyfish, though. That didn't work! Okay. Gargoyle's Great Axe. Thanks, dude. Any more mini-bosses you want to throw at me? Holy shit. Yeah, no wonder nobody lives out here. I have to deal with that nutcase every time they're just having a nice stroll. Give me a break. Oh boy. So many mini bosses in this video, dude. See, even the tree sentinels, even the double tree sentinels, they had like a little army that they were hanging out with. A little, uh. Oh. Your fingers. Please, your fingers! Please, I can read them. You got a big head, you know that? Your fingers, please, your fingers. Your head's like five times the size of mine. What's going on up there? I know it's not a big brain, so what else is happening? The fingers I served once prophesied. A tarnished would one day become Elden Lord and restore the Golden Order. Surely you see it too. Yeah, it's the me. Gold that enshrouds the heavens, the great tree which begets the pillars of light. Oh, tarnished. Hasten to the foot of the tree. <sighs> and whatever you might face, the fingers will surely guide you. <sighs> that was so not worth it. I just... Just wanna... Just wanna reiterate that. Okay. What's up here? What the hell? How do you... No! Oh, there's like a legit moat over here too. That thing like disappeared. Hi. You guys aren't lion guardians in disguise, are you? Eh, I'll come back for that thing. What? It's probably another Ash of War I wasn't gonna use anyway. <laughs> okay, so what's happening right here? Don't have the right? No, don't have the right! Okay, so not here. Pfft. Not here, not here, and not here. So... Gotta be here. Ooh, there's like a shack over here. Want that? There's another side of grace. This is skeletons. There's a merchant. Hi. 
There we go. Uh, we'll see what the merchant has. Oh my gosh. Sorry. That was really embarrassing. Hermit Merchant Is Shack. There? It's me. Customer? Yeah. Oh, how long has it been? Well, you know what they say, location, location, location. You got a shitty ass location. You got the worst location. Note below the capital. Oh, I'll take that note. You got any cookbooks or... No cookbooks? I'm gonna go ahead and get... Some rune arcs. Just because I end up using them. We can get an upper class robe if we want to be bougie. Do we want to be bougie? Festering bloody finger. Oh, I gotta invade for the for the guy with the white mask. I completely forgot about that. Something else? No, 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 nothing. Sorry. Okay. Well, thank you. Sorry if I made you yawn. I apologize. Okay. Um. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Let's go to the uh, minor urn tree. Which looks dead? Do they usually look dead? That, okay, I believe the last time this happened there was an ulcerated tree spirit. I don't care. What? What are you doing out here? What the hell? Look, it's got a skull! It's another one of these snake snail things! Look at them! Anyway, I don't care what boss there is, as long as it's not an ulcerated tree spirit. What skulls are these? Troll skulls, maybe? Eef. Okay. Take the blue right there. I've got 11 rune arcs now, nice. Here, we'll, we'll be able to spy from up here. Hey, idiots. what I get? Winged crystal tear? There's a crystal tear up here? Okay. Okay, what we got? What we got? It's actually not... It's not an Urge Avatar. It's some big guy with a sword? What's happening? Oh, there's an archer over there. Is he just shooting those guys? Or is he shooting at me? No, he's shooting those guys! Oh. Poor you! Poor, poor you! What the hell is that? I don't know. No, no, no! Don't take the Scarlet Rot! Preserving Bolus. I just want to swap this out for another spirit. I was thinking... Lutil the Headless. You ready for this? Look at us, we make quite the pair, don't we? What's that, huh? Oh, you're nothing. Oh, you're nothing. Dude, I just killed that gargoyle. You are absolute trash, you know that? Oh my gosh, why'd I even waste a summon? No way. What? You made me think it was serious. Twiggy cracked tear. Crimson Crystal Tear. Okay, let's take a look at these. So, Winged Crystal Tear temporarily reduces equip load. Okay. Twiggy briefly stops rune loss on death. Briefly stop rune loss on death. Okay, I made fun of it, but that's pretty sick, actually. And then... Wait, what was the other one? I don't know. I'm. A... That's actually pretty cool. I don't know if it's cool enough for me to... Like, actually mix it in, but... Wow, well, okay, this minor Erd tree here... Can I say? A bust? It was a bust, and not the fun kind. The fun kind is boobs. 
Just in case you didn't get what I was saying. I guess John's really into statues. John's really into statues of people from the shoulders up. He just referred to those kinds of busts as the fun kind. No, I didn't. I was talking about boobs, actually. Just to clear the air there. That's the fun kind. I know you guys don't know what fun is, but... That's why I'm here. To teach you the ways. Oh, wow. Look at you. See that? Here we go, it's another- Oh! I hate him! Nice try, idiot. Can I please attack? I like how they have no idea what to do when you get to this point. When you get right here, they're just like, oh, I guess I'll just die then. Yeah, I guess I'll just die, because I have no defense against this. That's why they try to get you from such a long range. I get it now. Do I even want to bother this guy? I mean, look at him. He doesn't know what's happening. Hey, friend. I'm just gonna take this real quick. Oh, Smitty Stone 5. Don't bother me. You won't get hurt. Okay, well. Uh, you won't listen to reason. Ow. Okay, that actually hurt. What a boring fight this is. Come back here. Oh, he got me on that one. I was talking so much shit to that guy. He's so tanky. He just has a million fucking HP, that's all. You can't be serious. Another tree sentinel? No way. What? Am I dreaming? There is no way. Hi. It's the draconic tree sentinel, okay. Whoa! He's got new tricks, y'all! Okay. I got new tricks too, let's go. Okay. So he can breathe fire. Okay, we've done a lot of damage to him. Oof. Nice attack, dude. Where'd you learn that? Okay, now with that said, I do have bad news for you. Um, you're dead. Draconic Tree Sentinel. Oh, I can breathe fire now. 50,000 for that guy? No way. Dragon Great Claw and Dragon Claw Shield. Fantastic, thank you so much. Didn't expect strong foe. That has zero appraisals. Nobody agrees with you. This is the way in? I mean, I'm assuming. I don't think there's anything else around here. I could be wrong, but I'm just gonna go ahead and Yeah, this is the way in, Ogre. All right. Okay. 
I did it. Lost Grace discovered. Okay, Capital Rampart. So we're officially going in, huh? After all this time. I'm trying to see if there's, I'm trying to figure out if there's anything else I want to like wrap up first or, hmm. It looks like there's actually, oh, there's another path that leads over here and stuff. So we don't have to go into the capital city just yet. I know you guys are itching to. I'm just thinking it might be a good thing to do next video, you know, so. Oh, 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 you know what I just saw over on the right? I just saw it. One of these useless little things over here. What's up? Oh, of course. Of course. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna drop down there. How do you get down there? No way I know, you go, you go around. Okay. Here we go. Draconic Tree Sentinel is kind of a bust, if you ask me. And not the fun kind. See, you guys know what I'm talking about with the fun kind now. Okay, here we are. We're underneath the bridge that I was just on top of. So you can go down this way. There's a bear! Oh! Remember when I was scared of you guys? Those are fun times. What do you think? They can't talk anymore. Oh! Thingy! What? Try turn back. What do you mean? Wait, what is this? Hang on. Okay, before we go in there, actually. What do you mean, try turn back? Okay, let's go up this way and see if there's an alternative. Oh! It's one of these things that you can get to smash open. What does it say? Ill-omened creature ahead. Okay, wait, if we can get... Is there a troll nearby that we can get to smash that? Oh! Oh! These things still scare the shit out of me. I don't know what it is about them. Hey, look! Smash it, smash it, smash it! Nice, dude! Oh my gosh. God, these... These bears, dude. Let me go get this! Huh. Can I get it? A spinning stone! Dude, how are these bears so crazy? <laughs> Okay, maybe I just have to... I mean, to be fair, I was trying to get the smithing stone, not necessarily kill it. Um... Oh wow, we're way over here. God. I think magic user, you know, sage robes guy over here is not really gonna... have a great time. Against a bear? I guess I can run now. Alright, what's up? Hey! A cave! Ariza side tomb. Oh, okay. Ariza, where have I heard that before? Si a side tomb. What? There's jars. I feel bad killing the jars. Well, a little bit. I'm just seeing Iron Alexander or whatever eat those guys. 
for new innards, I was like. Actually, kind of gross. Oh, it's a transporter trap! No! What? Wait, I wanted to. I wanted to get transported. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh my gosh. Get him. Get him. Pebble. Ha 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 Okay, cool. What, what are you gonna tell me? Beware of left, all right. Thank you. What would I do without you? Helpful messages. Oh, come on. Yeah, I mean, come on. Um, how about this? I think it's not a big deal. Ow. Wow. <laughs> what is this? Ritual pot. All that work for some for a ritual pot? Okay, I'm guessing maybe I do this one. You gotta do them in a certain order, I think. I assume that the enemies stay dead. Oh gosh. I would hope so, at least. Sorry. Visions of snake. <laughs> okay, awesome. Yeah, this is it. Oh, that work, it was worth it. Was it? I don't know, actually. Okay, it's boss time or mini boss time or whatever the hell. The Grave Warden Duelist. Oh, and he's got his buddies, the Jars. There we go. That was easy. All right. Now this is the third time I fought this guy? When does he get hard? Like when does he to get uh, difficult, I should say. Cause it ain't now. And we're in like the late mid game, right? Not late game, but late mid game. Soul Jars of Fortune Ashes. The... Sold Jars of Fortune. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. First you do a repeat boss. No, no, no. First you do a frustrating dungeon. Full of transporter traps. And then you do a repeat boss. And then you do a punt. Oh my god, I almost fell off. Anyway, let's go in this little thing right here. Because I don't know what the hell this is. It said turn back. I don't know why. Why would I turn back? Does this Is this another river well? Because these have always been very cool. I've, I've enjoyed these a lot. I liked uh, Siofra River. I liked uh, Ainsel. So hey, sign me up for more of this. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, oh. Oriza Hero's Grave, okay. So it's like French Folk Hero's Grave where we went in the very beginning of the playthrough, okay. Sure. Oh! 
Okay, you know what? Oh my god. Here we go. Die. I hate these froggy things. Light froggies. Oh, sorry. Did you want to get in close so you could throw up on me? No. These things. I hate these things. Look at them. Suck. You suck. What do you have to say? Be wary of right. Yeah. A little late for that. Now, golden epitaph. What? Golden epitaph is a straight sword. Unique skill, last rites. Raise the epitaph to grant the effect of sacred order to yourself and allies in the vicinity. Particularly effective at laying to rest those who live in death. Well, I don't really have much of a problem with those, so. Let's see, it's a sword made to commemorate the death of Godwin the Golden, first of the demigods to die. Why do I feel like we're gonna get a Black Knight Assassin in here then? Infused with the humble prayer of a young boy, O oh, brother, Lord brother, please die a true death. Huh. I appreciate all of it. Thank you for the straight sword. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. oh! What? What? It went way out. It went way out. Oh, 44k runes gone just like that. <sighs> No! How do you get to that? How the fuck do you get to that? Oh! Stupid! Stupid! Oh, stupid. Dumb. Okay. I guess we'll just keep going. It's like they were like, the French folk hero's grave wasn't challenging enough, so we're just trying to up the devil. Okay. I'm gonna wait. Oh, what? That is so dumb. You, you had like literally have enough time to do just that. You have enough time to do that and that's it. Oh. I hate this. I wish there was a way to kill these things. Oh, oh, nice try. Do you see that over there? Do you see that? It's just like, oh. Clown. Why don't you come over here and take this? How did I die there? What? No, no, no. How did I die? I, that's exactly where I was standing when it came up. It has a bigger hitbox on its right side than its left side. Is that what you're telling me? Because that's the only possible way that what I just witnessed would make sense. It has a bigger hitbox on the right side than the left side. Well, duly noted, I guess. You have to dodge in. Ugh. Get all the way back, get, get in the corner. Face the corner, put your nose to the corner. 
Oh my god. Stone sword keep. What? Okay. So does this thing roll over? This thing rolls over. Not the other one. Gonna crouch just in case. Nah. That is not... Okay. Oh. Oh, it's going down now? It's like, oh, it's like they sense where I am and then they're just like, that determines our route. Brother. Ugh. Oh no! No, I was dodging! I was dodging! Fun game! Fun video game! Fun video game, having a lot of fun! See, at the French Folk Hero's Grave, they went like... They went from like here... Right? And then they were just going back and forth... And it was just so... It, it took- it took so long for them to go from one side to the other. And this one, they're like, <laughs> they completely ruined it. They ruined it. If I get through this and there's just an ulcerated tree spirit at the end, I swear, I'm gonna turn the thing off. This playthrough will end at part 20 if that's the case. I think, I think that, I think this right here is the stupidest part. That, that right there, where you like, if you're like 0. 0.2 seconds off, you die. I hate that. No, no, no. There's nothing on this side. There's nothing on this side. There's nothing on that side. You have to go down the right, and I just lost 40k runes. It's not a big deal because I'm already level 100, but I'm just annoyed about it. There we go. Oh. Okay. Oh my god. Am I safe here? Can I stand here? Is that okay? You sure it doesn't have like an eight meter reach on the inside? You sure? Can I see where I'm going? Okay, I just need to get past these pillars. Okay. But then... Oh, that's so stupid! That's so stupid! Oh, that is the dumbest shit ever! Holy... I'm blown away! I'm blown away at what a stupid sh like... I think this is- I think this is probably the first time in the game that I'm like, frustrated... ...and not having fun. Cause anytime I've been frustrated before, I'm like... Oh, yeah, it's my fault, and I could have played that better. Oh my god, dude. I guess you- do you just stand- do you stand in the middle of the pillars, I guess? But then are you sure you won't get clipped by the spike? I hate this. Okay, can you stand perfectly in the center? You actually can. That I was a microsecond off. Right here. Oh my god. No. I 
was... I was in between! Oh, it does cut you in between! Oh, <laughs> oh my god. So what you've gotta do, is you gotta... Put your right foot in, put your right foot out, basically. How the fuck does this happen? Oh my gosh, I hate that. Oh, let me in, let me in, let me in! It's like Eric Andre. The Eric Andre meme, let's go, get me in here, get me out of there. First off, I want to go home. I hear you. I hear you, my friend. There's more? No, okay, no, there's just a boss. There's just a boss. How bad could the boss be? Let's do this, come on. Don't care. Oh, double crucible night. No way. 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 Two Crucible Knights? Now I understand why there was a message that was like, you should consider turning back. <laughs> hey buddy, maybe don't go this way. Oh, I hate it. I know it wants me to parry. But that's just not my style. Shut it. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> they- that is crazy. Okay, I think I need to- I need to readjust my armor. I'm running in there with like, magician's robes. I know, it, typically it's like fashion souls, right? A lot of, a lot of people in the comments take it really seriously, but- Let's be real, a lot of it is fashion souls, right? You just wear whatever you want. However, I do think it is gonna be worth putting my heaviest shit on. And we're going pumpkin helm, you know it, okay? This, here's what we're gonna do. Because magic against Crucible Knight, I don't think, I mean, I could be wrong, I don't think it works. So we are going to, um, two hand the moon veil. Are those skeletons barrel rolling? Wow. Okay, let's go, let's go. What the hell? Holy shit. Get this. No! No! 
No, 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 I want to get your shieldless brother over there. There we go. No. They've got such reach. Okay. Oh, this is insane. Damn. Okay. Oh my god. No. I got one of them in second stage. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh. What the hell? Why is this- why does this place suck so bad? It sucks in here. This is terrible. Get me out. Oh. I have not been over here. Okay. Mm, can I hop down? I think I should be able to hop down here. Yeah. What? What the hell? Okay, so there is a sacred tear. Hello. Hello, my friend. You look like a bloody finger. Cool. Gotcha. What? What's up? Oh no! Dog! Oh. Touch three phantom crests. Oh, like this? Oh, that's what that thing was earlier! Wait. That's where that thing was earlier? Okay, hang on. Oh, and what was I, I- look, I bought this thing, and then I never looked at it. Below the capital. Below the royal capital city of Lindell is a vast network of sewers. The well in the city below reaches deep into its tunnels. Okay. That wasn't really that helpful, but sure. Now, was there a map that I just got? A simple map concerning a rise that vanishes like a mirage. Oh, I think... Okay. And then, so it's... Oh my god, so it's all the way over here. Yeah. Here we go. Alright, so that was... So that was the second one, so the third one... The third one has got to be, like, right here, somewhere. Oh! Wait, did I get all three? Oh my god. I got all three, and I was sitting there like, where is the third one? It's because I got the third one, like, ages ago, in another video. I was sitting there like, where is it? It's supposed to be right here. 
Wow. Okay. I didn't know that it was like, once you got them, it was permanent. This is all for another memory stone. I mean, how many spells does one guy need, you know? Oh, there's actually two things here. Unseen blade, that's an incantation. And unseen form. I think those are both incantations. Slumbering egg? Okay. Well, cool. Um, I mean, I guess that was fun. There's a golden seed up here? Okay. What? No. Yura, I haven't seen him in ages. He's the guy that helped me in my first Bloody Finger Invader fight. Way back in Limgrave. Oh wow, look, he's here. Okay. I'm coming in, dude. Coming in hot. Bloody Finger Raven Mountain Assassin, that's... No problem. We can do this. Oh, easy. I was supposed to do that way earlier in the game, huh? <laughs> cool, I got a rune arc for that. Ash of War, Raptor of the Mists. Neato. Okay. Oh! Listen, he's, he's shivering over here. Are you okay? Oh, oh, it's you. Thanks for your help there. You're awkward, you know that? There was a thorn in my side. And now I'm finally rid of him. Okay. Here's a token of thanks. Please, take it. Wow. I may not have much time. I'm dying to see you, Eleonora. Violet Bloody Finger. Okay. Yes, I've been tracking Eleonora for quite some time. She kind is of a the creeper, huh? of all bloody fingers. Oh, really? She's felled many an old hand already. Okay. But in spite of her cess-blood salutary, Eleonora is a proud knight. Ah, uh, my if quest. she comes for you, do not think twice. You must flee. There is no shame in self-preservation. Definitely, dude. Be on your way. Perhaps we will meet again. If fate permits. Yeah, sure. You said that last time. There's actually a golden seed over here. Holy. I never went on this bridge over here in Lyurnia. I never did. So we just completely missed this. Isn't that horrible? We can add another flask uh, charge. Oop. Okay, we don't want to go down there. Yeah, too high up. I know. Ah, oh, damn. Well, it's cool to see that there was still some stuff in Lyurnia that I had yet to do. I mean, besides this stuff. I do want to know, actually. There we go. I don't think I ever did this one. I didn't. I never did this ever jail. Oh, this will be a cinch. Let's go. I don't know who this is, but you're going down. Is it a Crucible Night Part 2 or what? A dawn, thief of fire. Look at how much one hit does to him. Holy shit. Okay. Look at do you see him? He 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 drank a little health potion. That's cool. Now uh let's stop messing around, shall we? Nope, you don't get to drink that. <laughs> oh, that's too bad, buddy. Bye-bye. Flame of the Fell God. And like, 4,000 runes. Yeah, wake me up when it's something worth fighting for, huh? There, he did it, so I guess I shouldn't complain. Alright, so full disclosure, I looked up where Bloody Finger Yura goes next. And it's actually right here, which is funny because I was just here. I, I've tried not to look up too much stuff about the game, but after finding out that I had missed him 
before at Rey Lucaria, I was like, I gotta make sure I get him in the next spot, so. What's up, dude? Eleonora. It seems I am no match for you, but I've learned a thing or two myself. You see, I've sliced the finger off. Please. Please. Eleonora. Yield to the cesspit no longer. Do not stain the immaculacy of your soul. Your flesh. Your fire. So what, he just dies? Nagakiba, that's a katana. Oh, here she is. Yeah, really? That's crazy. Oh, look at you. Ooh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna do that from now on. No more shitty little dragon attacks. How are you? No. You don't get to drink that. I really hate that sound effect that he makes. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay, here we go. There we go. That one was a lot quicker. Huh. Purifying Crystal Tear. Eleanor's Pole Blade. Let's look at the Crystal Tear. Where is it? I can't remember. Here it is. Purifying Crystal Tears. Get ready to be impressed. This is gonna be a good one. Purifies the Lord of Blood's Curse. The resulting concoction purifies the curse from Mog, Lord of Blood's terrifying ride of blood. Huh? I don't know who Mog is. But I'm guessing I will be, uh, excited that I get to counteract them, huh? Um, and then... Eleanor's pole blade's actually a twin blade with arcane scaling. Ooh, and blood loss. Blood blade dance. Leap at foe to perform a flurry of tornado-like attacks. Follow up with an additional input to perform an attack that ends in an evasive maneuver. That seems cool. Look, oh my god, it looks like Darth Maul's lightsaber. It really is Darth, y'all. This is it. Oh, holy shit, we're gonna use that in the next video. Yes. We're gonna use that in the next video. I liked that, what was that other one? That we got from the Godskin Apostle? The Godskin Peeler. We can do this one too! We could do, we could do Strength Dex, we could do Quality Build again, and we could have two different weapons that we could just, like, switch out whenever we want to. Alright, that's what that we got a plan for next video. Yes. Alright, guys, I think I'm going to end the video now. In this video, we did a lot of side stuff. Although we did we took a couple trips down memory lane, we beat three tree sentinels in this video. Three. We beat Margaret again, we beat some big gargoyle thing, and we uncovered uh, the hardest boss that I've seen so far, the double crucible knight. Hello! We'll do that some other time. Uh, we got some really cool weapons, the Godskin Peeler and Eleonora's Pole Blade. 
We even did some NPC quests. A little, uh, little Bloodyfinger Yura action there. And, um, I think we made some good progress. In the next video, we'll be making our way into, like, officially into the royal capital of Lindell. Oh, yeah, we also went to the Divine Tower, which was very uneventful. Um... But yeah, we're going to be going in here and uh, exploring this area in part 21. You know, we just kind of milled around and did a bunch of different stuff. But in the next video, we'll be going into the rural capital, which I suspect will be very exciting. So I'll see you then. Thanks for watching. Think critically.